World's fastest train, 603 kilometers, Japan. Hey everyone, welcome to our channel. If you're new here, welcome. And consider subscribing to my channel and click that little bell notification below. If you are a person who is alert about trains, then you might have heard that a seven car train established a land speed record for rail cars of 603 kilometers per hour on April 21st, 2015. And yes, that is the world's fastest train so far. So why wouldn't it be a topic to discuss? Watch till the end and I promise you'll learn a lot. First, let me tell you the scientific background of this outstanding speed. The train, which set that speed record of 603 kilometers per hour, was one from the L0 series. It's a high-speed maglev train developed and tested by the Central Japan Railway Company, also known as JR Central. Now you might get the question, what is a maglev train? Maglev is the short form of magnetic levitation. This is a technology in which they use magnetic force to lift the cars off the ground, reducing or eliminating track friction. The magnetic repulsion between the vehicles and the rail is the basis for how maglev trains operate. This electrodynamic suspension system makes the train magnetically levitate or float. Because there's less friction, they can travel faster than regular trains. Currently, trains using maglev technology can reach speeds of more than 500 kilometers per hour. Trials for the maglevs, which will supplement the Shinkansen bullet train network established in 1964 and where trains can already go as quickly as 320 kilometers per hour, resumed in August 2013 at JR Central. The company spent five years constructing a 24 kilometer test track extension that will allow coaches to go at the same speed as commercial operations, or 500 kilometers per hour. The record-breaking run, which showed the 603 km per hour speed, is a component of tests before JR Central can begin operating the Tokyo Nagoya line commercially in 2027. So what's special about this L0 series? Although it could reach the speed of 603 km per hour, the trains are expected to travel at a maximum speed of 505 km per hour. They'll run between Shinagawa Station in Tokyo and Nagoya in 40 minutes and between Tokyo and Osaka in an hour and seven minutes. The L0 series uses the SC Maglev system created in Japan. Currently, a subsidiary of JR Central called Nippon Shario and Mitsubishi Heavy Industries are constructing 14 pre-production cars. L0 class train sets have end carriages that are 28 meters long and can accommodate 24 passengers. For improved aerodynamics and less noise in tunnels, the nose is extended by 15 meters. Each intermediate car has a length of 24.3 meters and can accommodate 68 passengers. As opposed to JR Central Shikansen trains, each row is one seat narrower at four broad. In order to provide additional inside space, the cars are more box-shaped than the preceding models. The white and blue colors of the cars will definitely get your attention. The best part is the L0 series doesn't need a driver. But you don't have to worry as the train contains a camera at the front of each car to enable remote operation if the automated systems malfunction. The camera is more visible on the updated end cars, which will be available starting in 2020. The journey between Tokyo and Nagoya will be quicker than either flying between the two cities or traveling the present Tokaido line, accessible with the Japan Rail Pass. The train will stop at the stations in Shinagawa, Sagamihara, Kofu, Ida, and Nakatsugawa. The original intention behind the Maglev project was to build a train that could travel the distance between Tokyo and Osaka in under an hour. This will be accomplished when the Maglev line is extended from Nagoya to Osaka, which is anticipated to be operational by 2045.